Bien. Vamos. Ya ustedes saben que el puro que nosotros hacemos en nuestra finca se llama Montecristo número 4. Okay, you already know that the cigar we roll here is named Montecristo number 4 and that's because of the amount of the leaf here. Okay? Four leaf. One, Porque se two, hace de cuatro folias. Es un puro de mezcla media, ni muy fuerte ni muy suave. Okay, um, he's explaining the same. Medio puro. Yes, I was explaining you for, and when he gets something new, I tell you. Okay. Estas hojas de color más claro, ¿eh? Son de la parte de abajo de la planta, mañanita y libra de pie. Esta más fina, suave, elástica, sedosa, del centro de la planta. Y esta de mayor grosor, más oscura, de arriba de la corona. Pero nosotros, a la hora de hacer un puro, hacemos una mezcla, combinación de las hojas. Una, dos, tres y cuatro. Pero nosotros retiramos la vena central de la hoja. Okay, two parts here. This part is for the uh, combustion, okay? The fill. And this part is for rolling everything, is the binder, okay? So we then we cut. And finally, the cycle. Then we cut. We use the guillotine, okay? French invention, okay? Chaveta. Cut. Ah, chaveta. We cut, we cut, and we don't waste any of the of the leaf. We combine. Como todo everything. se le pone al puro de nuevo. Combinación. Sí. Comenzamos so, a enrolar start, start la tripa en el capote. We are pressing at the same time, okay? okay? To make it tighter, right? Yeah. Comenzamos a dar un poquito de masaje. Now we like a massage the uh the cigar. Mm. I feel the smell. Ahora, como el puro que nosotros hacemos es un puro orgánico artesanal, el pegamento que utilizamos es okay. miel. Yeah. So the cigar we make, we roll here is handmade cigar. And because of that, we uh, use honey as a glue, okay? In factories, they use maple syrup, okay? The uh, national uh, tree of Canada for uh, seal the cigar. Guillotine, francés, para dar los cortes. Then we cut. So. Ahora lo ponemos en este papel. We use this for the post, okay? <laughs> Para okay. prensarlo. Now we use a piece of paper for press more the cigar. The factory they use machines, okay? Here we don't have and uh, everything we do is natural, so we use a piece of paper. Comenzamos a prensar. The more you press, uh, uh, the more. Uh, yeah. you press. Después de prensado, 
lo ponemos al sol por 15 o 20 minutos. After press, we we put it to the sun like 15, 8, 20 minutes. Okay, that for the uh, sun, it need paper absorb the humidity inside. Okay. Okay. Porque el sol le absorbe la humedad que tiene. Y preparamos la parte final del puro, que es la capa. La capa del puro es una hoja del centro de tabaco seco, una capa fina, elástica, que estira. Quitamos el protector. Ya está prensado el puro. We pass the final part. It's like the the wrapper. We we pass it. Uh, we press, but just a little bit, not too much. Mm -hmm. My grandfather used to say that um, she cuts like a woman, okay? The more you free her kind and mm. this, uh, your hand all over, over here, you know, the best that she cut, okay? Medimos, buscando el tamaño aproximado de la vitola. So we use the, the hand, like like measure, for the size of the cigar, okay? She cuts with very breast, okay? Now we are going to compare. Can I taste this one? No, no. Why? Because uh, you, you need Vamos to wait for three days. Okay. Pass okay. for three days. Okay. There's no humidity inside the cigar, and you can smoke it, but not right now. Perfecto. Ahora, este que hemos hecho tiene humedad. Ven como doble. There's a lot of humidity inside. Ah, okay. Es necesario ponerlo en el papel. Y durante tres días no se puede consumir. So we put it back in the piece of paper and in three days you can smoke it. Porque el papel le absorbe toda la humedad hasta que lo seca completamente. And that's because we, the, uh, we use the paper for absorption the, the all, all the humidity. Después si lo traemos a estos paquetes que aquí sí están listos para consumir. And after those three days we actually can package paper. them inside a palm leaf, okay? Explica el proceso. Proceso y conservación de este puro. Okay, now for preserve the the package and with the package the tobacco, okay, the the, the cigar, okay. We uh, here in Cuba the level of humidity are very high, like 75 percent of humidity, okay. And for preserve that we don't need more than the package but maybe in germany and where you're from sweden, sweden um you may use a humidor mm. and if you don't have one okay you can use the bottom of the fridge okay you use the bottom of the fridge we put the package inside a plastic bag and in the bottom of the fridge why plastic bag okay uh, a plastic bag is for it's because uh, the cigar is like a sponge, okay. And when you put uh, the cigar next to a vegetable or some fruit or cheese, uh, the cigar absorbs the strong smells. And when you're going to smoke it, you are going uh, you're going to smoke uh, I don't know pi pineapple or cheese or anything else, not cigars, okay. And we don't want that. We want to smoke cigar, right? So. Because of that, we use the, the plastic bag. Okay, so plastic bag, we put in bottom of the fish and last four years. Okay, wow. in four years you have a lot of uh, special occasions, you know, and you can smoke, uh, gift, whatever you like, weddings, uh, birthdays. It's up to you. Okay, so we put up uh, ten of these cigars in each package. Okay, and we sell them. Forty dollars each package. Okay, it's like four dollars by each cigar. Okay, in factories they sell um, each cigar like twelve, forty, 
fifty dollars, okay? And the whole box is like three three hundred, three hundred and a half. Okay. We sell it cheaper because we uh, it's a natural process and we don't have to waste uh, a lot of resources a lot a lot of resources for um, to finally roll the cigar. It's just us. Okay, because of that we sell it cheaper and also it's a good quality cigar. Okay. Many people used to come here and say a lot of things about a lot of good things about our cigars. Okay. Now we are going to try one. Remember always to put some honey. Okay. Honey works like a natural filter like like a shield for protecting the lips and mouth and everything, okay? So when we are going to smoke, we put some honey, we stop uh, we start inhaling and just to the mouth, in and out. Okay, we don't yes, have to laugh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because you maybe you get some DC. Okay, it's like uh, when you smoke too fast or smoke too many cigars. It's like uh, it's like you you've been um, drinking uh, a bottle of rum. Okay, and you you get DC. Okay, and um, to avoid that, you enjoy the cigar. Okay, you smoke now and. So, okay, it's just for enjoy, for a, t a small talk, or I don't know, whatever you like. But enjoy the cigar. Don't smoke it like like a cigarette because it's not like that. Okay. So now we are going to try one. Okay. Yes. Okay. Are you very lazy? <laughs> now we are going to walk all, up, all over the table. Over the table. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. No, no, I was explaining. I was explaining that to the to them. No, no, no. I... Okay. I'm here. <laughs> You're here. Okay, then we are going to smoke one cigar now. Pa, pa, bueno. Tron de cigarro. Profesional. <laughs> You're a smoker? No. Okay. <laughs> Not smoker. <laughs> but this was nice. Oh. Yeah. Papa. I can actually come to Okay, yeah. I don't know. No, it's a cosa. Put some honey. Remember the honey is uh, uh, it's like a very important part of smoking cigars in Chiba. 